Welcome to Ecstatic Yoga. I am Grace. We will be practicing Kapalabhati today. It is a vitalizing pranayam. And this pranayam is a little different than some of the others. It's also called the skull shining breath. Benefits are it exercises um, the abdominals and the diaphragm massages and stimulates internal organs, clears air passages, it improves digestion, it calms and uplifts the mind, improves blood circulation, energizes the nervous system and the brain, and clears the nadis, the energy body. Contraindications are anyone with a pacemaker or a stent, epilepsy, epilepsy, hernia, slip discs, anyone recovering from abdominal surgery and pregnancy. Some modification variations is you can place your hand on the belly to feel the abdominal muscles contract. And we're keeping our awareness on the, breathe, the exhale. Let's talk a little bit about the skull shining breath. Kapal means cranium or forehead. Bhati means light, perception, or knowledge. Bringing light and clarity to the frontal regions of the brain. Focuses on the exhale and the inhale occurs naturally. The exhale is rapid and comes from the belly. We will be pulling the belly in towards the spine. The time allowed for the inhale is about double or triple the time needed for the exhale. And it's important to keep your body relaxed. So you can be in a seated position with the, the spine straight. You can be in a cushion, a chair, or a block. I'm going to go through the steps first, and then we're going to practice the pranayam together. So we're going to inhale deeply through both nostrils and fill the entire chest. And then we're going to be, begin to exhale, expel the breath with a rapid exhalation through the nose. And we're going to be drawing the navel in towards the spine. So it's going to be like this. Allow the inhale to be drawn in naturally. Don't focus on the inhale. The moment you relax the abdominal muscles after that exhale, the inhale occurs naturally without any effort. Again, expel the breath with a rapid exhale and continue with a steady rhythm. And the rounds are suggested at 27, 54, or 108. And I'm not sure how they got to those numbers. But let's practice the pranayam together. So you can bring your hand to the belly if you like. Either hand works. To feel that the abdominal muscles and that navel coming in towards the spine. So let's together take a nice deep inhale and begin our exhale. One more. And let it go. So hopefully that's enough practice and you do several, probably about three rounds is what's recommended. Thank you so much for being here with Ecstatic Yoga. I am Grace. Please go to ecstaticyoga.studio to check out our yoga teacher trainings and our yoga retreats. They are all amazing. Hope you can join us. Wishing you a most beautiful and most blessed day. Namaste.